Hello everyone. In this video I want to show how to make a projection on a dome using the hooks of HDR I Maker add-on. Add an HDR background. Now let's go to the dome menu which is the one dedicated to domes. Make sure you have selected cube from the dome type menu. Press add dome. Now let's adjust the rotation of the image on the dome. As being a cube, the position of the image will not always be right. Let's go to the dome vectors menu. We adjust the angle. To have a correct illumination, we also link the rotation to the background. Press link button. Now the background rotation is linked to the rotation of the dome projection. From the hooks menu let's add the hooks, by pressing the add hooks button. 26 hooks will be added to the dome. Let's select the hooks we want to move, to move the walls of the dome. We make them slide, until the boundary between the floor and the wall is just right. This technique is used to trace the original geometry of the photographed environment. Internal hooks are only used in case two or more edges overlap, creating an annoying flickering effect. Then we move them too, along with the perimeter ones. The walls seem not parallel to those of the dome, we can rotate the hooks, by pressing keyboard R, rotation. Let's rotate the other wall a little too. Let's give one last fix to the last wall as well. Okay, the geometry, it seems to follow the original environment. Now it only remains to adjust the hook on the ceiling, as it is too high. We now have a much more realistic scene as a result. Let's adjust the bottom edge of the projection, as it looks too distorted. By adjusting the adjust boundary slider we can exactly adjust the border area between the floor and the walls. We can also adjust the position of the projection on the walls. This can help to better define the projection. We can still adjust adjust boundary. The purpose has been achieved, we have a projection on a custom geometry dome. By activating the display wire box we can also see the dome wireframe. This can be useful in some situations. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to stay updated on news.